airmen from the maintenance squadron of the 144th Fighter Wing are updating their skill set as the Fighter Wing transitions from F-16s to F-15s in order to best support the Wing's mission of worldwide air superiority. Well, currently we're in the middle of an F-15 conversion. The F-16s are going out, the F-15s are coming in. With the three F-15s we have on the ramp, we're conducting field training school. Uh, the aircraft behind me uh, is a weapons class going on. They're doing a gun install. So we'll spend the next couple months just training our maintenance personnel and working on the F-15, being able to repair and turn it. Uh, and then sometime in October, we'll start flying the F-15 in earnest. The NCOs, as always, are the leaders of the unit, so whether we're converting, whether we're standing down, whether we're working normal operations, their role generally is the same. They need to lead the younger airmen, they need to mentor the younger airmen, uh, make sure they're ready to take on this new challenge. Uh, we have some exceptional NCOs, so we'll have no problem in that regard. Uh, conversion is going smoothly, actually. No hiccups. Uh, we needed to get three F-15s here for school. They're here. The instructors are here from across the nation. Uh, F-16s are trans uh, transitioning out to their new locations so everything's been going very smooth as our colonel has said numerous times you know the right uh, tool in the right place at the right time so uh, we're excited I think the troops are excited and uh, we look forward to October when we're putting jets in the sky again finally after uh, several several years of waiting we're finally getting the f-15 it's a huge change for the maintenance group uh, the maintenance group uh, has maintained the F-16 for about 24 years and so they're obviously we're very familiar with the F-16 and how it works and how to fix it and now we're getting a different aircraft and we have to work to become just as proficient on the new aircraft, the F-15, as we were on the F-16 and that's going to take us some time. We, uh, right now we have maintainers in class uh, being taught F-15 systems, how they operate, how to troubleshoot them and uh, eventually when we finish the, the uh, training portion in uh, about the beginning of October, we'll actually start flying the F-15, and that will give us our best chance of, of really learning, because we'll be flying aircraft that will be coming back with system problems, and we'll have to troubleshoot those problems and repair them and make the aircraft uh, mission ready again. For the 144th Fighter Wing Public Affairs, this is Master Sergeant David Leffler.